Welcome back to the Patagonia Expedition. After starting our hitchhiking adventure along the Carretera Austral with stops in Chaiten, La Junta and Puyuapi in the last episode, we keep traveling by thumb into rural Patagonia, where we hike to Cerro Castillo and take a boat to the impressive marble caves of Puerto Rio Tranquilo in this episode. Good morning from rainy Puyuapi. Our plan for today is to get from Puyuapi to Koyaike. And this is our last view, hopefully, to Puyuapi. Friends of hitchhiking and adventures, we just had the most uncomfortable ride uh, on this whole trip. We were in the back of a pickup truck and thought it's maybe a good idea to squeeze in between motorcycles and bicycles. But How was then, it? Then everything went numb and these are not paved roads. There's potholes everywhere so we were just... This bumpy <laughs> ride took us to the Bosque Encantado which is here but it's also very wet. It's still raining, we're totally soaked. Yeah, we're waiting for the sun now. Alright guys, we're again in the back of a pickup truck and this time Celine and Stanley took us. They're standing over there. Isn't it adorable? The ride on the back of Celine and Stanley's pickup truck turned out to be the most beautiful as the sun finally came out and we got to enjoy an open panoramic view of the incredible landscape from the Bosque Encantado all the way down to Coyhaique. A stretch of altogether 160 kilometers. We made it to Koyaike. And this is our ride. <laughs> Bye. We are on the road again. We're leaving Koyaike today after a few days relaxing here, charging up, and we're heading to Via Cerro Castillo. <laughs> which is somewhere there in the back. You see these mountains? As we found our ride, it's Cesar. Brings us to Via Cerro Castillo. We go hiking tomorrow. Cesar not only made a few stops to show us his favorite spots along the way, he also told us that he is in the process of building a hostel in Via Cerro Castillo to share the beauty of his region with travelers from all around the world. So we're now at the construction area of Cesar's future hostel which you can see here. Good morning! Today we're about to hike to the Cerro Castillo. This is the mountain over there, but first we're gonna have breakfast. So, we got our water resources. And now we're ready to go up hill. The day hike to Cerro Castillo is an alternative to the beautiful four-day trek from Horquetas to Via Cerro Castillo. This is Via Cerro Castillo, that's where we came from. Ooh, and now we're up here. It's quite exhausting. 1,000 meter of elevation. This down there was pretty impressive, but now look what I found here. We made it! We made it! Cerro Castillo is a jagged rocky peak located within the Cerro Castillo National Reserve. Castillo means castle in Spanish and the steep basalt walls of the mountain indeed make it look like one. On its sides are a few small glaciers and lakes fed by them. That was nice, but now it's time to head back down to the valley to Via Cerro Castillo. So 
this is Cerro Castillo and we are back in town. So we found dinner and <laughs> beer. <laughs> Good morning guys, we're up for going down to the next village to Puerto Rio Tranquilo today by a hitchhiking. And rule number one about hitchhiking, never do so on an empty stomach. Oh yeah. <laughs> Hello, so we are talking to you from Richard and Penny's car. They picked us up about 15 minutes into the hitchhike, which was good because the road was going to close in an hour and a half. <laughs> and we got a beautiful scenic ride. We got dropped off where we wanted to be tonight in Puerto Rio Tranquilo. It's time to show you uh, what traveling really is like when you do this kind of things here because you don't find lavanderias all the way, you have to wash your stuff. Next door is Kristen doing her laundry. Lavanderia. <laughs> this is the lavanderia de la casa, <laughs> the homemade laundry. All right, and here is the situation with electricity, like most of the times you just have one plug. So we have to convert in the plug to plug in the power cube, which has all these outlets. Hola from Puerto Rio, tranquilo. We are back with Pato, who's down there preparing the boats. And you might remember that place because I was here three years ago when Pato was my last lift when I came from the other side, when I came from Villa O'Higgins. He took me to Puerto Rio Tranquilo and later on took me out on his boats. And now I met up with him again to do exactly the same thing. The Marble Caves are an unusual geological formation located at the center of the General Carrera Lake, which is also the second largest lake of Chile. They represent a group of caverns, columns and tunnels formed into monoliths of marble which have been formed by wave action over the last 6200 years. So now we can see yeah. the dock. <laughs> So we're back in safe harbor. How was it? Awesome. Beautiful. Stay tuned for the next episode where we will explore the northern Patagonian ice field and head down to the end of the Carretera Austral in Via O'Higgins. So subscribe to this channel for new travel videos every Thursday and check out my Chile travel guide if you also want to explore this region. Finally, thanks for watching. Hasta pronto. Good morning. Good morning, Kristen. <laughs> Have a nice trip. Oh yeah, wait. <laughs> we have another oh. another back. It's just the passport inside. Not, nothing important. <laughs>